393 gigawatts. That's how much nuclear energy the world has today, making up 10% of the world's electricity supply and from 444 nuclear energy reactors operating in 30 countries around the world. 1,160 gigawatts. That's how much nuclear energy the world would need by 2050 in order to contain climate change to less than 1.5 degrees Celsius. And that's according to a review of over 90 possible pathways to net zero by the United Nations Intergovernmental Panel on Climate Change. Now, nuclear energy already makes an important contribution to climate change mitigation. By displacing 1.6 gigatons of carbon dioxide emissions every year. And that's almost twice the annual emissions of the entire aviation sector. But global nuclear energy capacity would need to triple in the next three decades. And the world is simply not on track to meet these targets. Reaching net zero will require clean electricity and clean fuels. And nuclear energy can provide both. It provides reliable, dispatchable, non-emitting electricity. It provides baseload power, and it provides much needed backup to enable even greater penetration of variable renewable sources of power generation like wind and solar. And with a wave of new innovations like small modular reactors and nuclear produced hydrogen, the nuclear energy sector can do so much more. New analysis by the OECD Nuclear Energy Agency estimates that with these technological innovations, the nuclear energy sector can reach the target of 1,160 gigawatts by 2050, and that would displace 87 gigatons of emissions between 2020 and 2050. And the path to success is narrow, but we can achieve this, and the window to act is now. Thank you.